In this video, I'll be showing you how to fix EA Anti-Cheat install failed error when trying to install the EA Anti-Cheat service. So this service is required to play a lot of the EA games. So luckily there are a couple of things that we can do to fix the install error message. But before we get started, I just want to say I will pop a link in the description below to a guide that we will do on how to fix this error message which may have more methods that I didn't get to add in this video. So it's definitely worth checking out that link if none of the methods in this video help you out. So the first thing that you need to do is just simply go to the location of the game that you're having issues with. So in this video, for example, I'm going to use FIFA 23, which means all I need to do is right click on the FIFA 23 shortcut and go open file location. And then once you're in the install location of the game that you're having issues with, you will then see an installer folder. You need to open this up and you then need to open up the EA anti-cheat folder. You will then see EA anti-cheat installer. So you need to right click on this file and go run as administrator. You now need to click on the drop down menu and you then need to select the game that you're having issues with. So if you have already uninstalled EA anti-cheat, then that's fine. If you haven't, then press uninstall. But seeing as you're on this video, you probably have already uninstalled it. So now you can see that I've got the install option. You then need to just simply press install. And this is then going to install EA Anti-Cheat. And because we ran it with admin privileges, then hopefully that would have fixed the error message. But don't worry, because if that didn't work, then the next thing you need to do is click on the link that's in the description below to go to the EA website. You will then end up on a page that looks like this. You need to scroll down. And you will then see an option that says download the EA Anti-Cheat Installer. You need to go ahead and click on this link. And once the file's finished downloading, go ahead and run the file. Again, you will now end up with the window to uninstall and install EA Anti-Cheat. So we need to select the game again and press uninstall. And then you then need to select the game again and then press install. And hopefully that would have helped install the EA Anti-Cheat. But if that didn't help fix the issue, then the next thing that you need to do is right click on your start menu icon and then open up Task Manager. You then need to go across to Services. You then need to scroll down through the services until you come across E. You will then see EA Anti-Cheat Service. So you can see mine currently says Stopped. You need to right click on this service and just go Stop. And you also need to do the same for the EA background service. Just right click and go stop. Also, make sure you do not have either Origin or the EA app open. And also make sure that you don't have the game open that you're trying to install EA anti-cheat for. This also includes ensuring that you have everything else closed, such as web browsers, Razer Cortex, for example, RGB software, Discord, anything else you may have running on your computer. And if you are using a third party security program, then disable it. You won't be protected from security threats though while it's disabled, so just keep that in mind. Or you may be able to put your third party security program into a passive or game mode. Once you've done all that and closed everything down, go ahead again and just simply press the install button. If that didn't help fix the issue, then the next thing that you need to do is just close all of this down. And you then need to open up the start menu and type in msconfig. You then need to open up System Configuration. You now need to go across to Services and you then need to tick Hide All Microsoft Services. You then need to go through this list and just simply deselect as much of the options as you can. If you're happy just to disable everything because you just really want to get the EA Anti-Cheat installed, then just select Disable All and then press Apply. But just keep in mind if you do have any security software or anything there, then that will also be disabled. So once you've done that, the next thing you need to do is go across to Startup and you then need to click on Open Task Manager. You again also need to go through this list and just right click on anything that you do not want to start up with Windows. Again, the more that you disable, the better, as there could be something also in this list conflicting with the EA anti-cheat, stopping it from installing onto your computer. Once you've disabled all the startup and services that you're happy to disable, go ahead and restart Windows and then try and install the EA Anti-Cheat. If that did fix the error, then you can go back through and re-enable your startup programs and services. However, if that didn't work, then also go onto Task Manager and open up the Users tab and just make sure no one else is currently logged into your computer. If they are, then select their user profile and then click on Sign Out. 
just make sure they got everything saved before you do that. So that does now bring me to the end of this video. I hope this video helped you out and you enjoyed it. Like I said at the start of the video, I will pop a link in the description below to a guide that may have more methods. So if the video didn't help you out, then check out that guide. If you did like the video, click the like button below. And if you want to see more computer sluggish videos, then click that subscribe button. If you do subscribe, then I will see you in the next video.